write the balance reaction for the complete combustion of octane or C8H18. Octane is an example of what we call a hydrocarbon. Hydrocarbons are compounds composed of only two elements, hydrogen and carbon. So hydrocarbon. The problem says that hydrocarbon undergoes combustion. What do we mean by combustion? Combustion is reaction with oxygen gas. So the other reactant in the reaction is oxygen gas. And the problem specified that the combustion is complete. When you say complete combustion of a hydrocarbon, the products are carbon dioxide, and water. So any hydrocarbon that undergoes complete combustion produces carbon dioxide and water. So our hydrocarbon is octane, C8H18, plus oxygen gas is O2, carbon dioxide is CO2, and water is H2O. To balance this reaction, we need to consider three elements, carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So the number of each element must be equal on both the left and the right sides of the equation. I will give you a tip, balance first carbon, then hydrogen, and lastly, balance oxygen. So let's start with carbon. We have eight carbons on the left side and only one carbon on the right side. So how do we balance carbon? We put the coefficient eight on carbon dioxide because eight times one, that's equal to eight. So carbon is already balanced. Next is hydrogen. There are 18 hydrogens on the left side and two hydrogens on the right side. So how do we balance hydrogen? We put the coefficient 9 on water because 9 times 2, that's equal to 18. So hydrogen is already balanced. And lastly, let's look for oxygen. On the left side, we have two oxygens. And on the right side, we have 8 times 2, that's 16, plus 9 times 1, that's 9. So 16 plus 9, that's equal to 25. So we have 2 on the left and 25 on the right. So how do we balance oxygen? We put the coefficient 25 over 2 or 25 halves on O2. Because 25 halves times 2, that's equal to 25. Since all elements are already balanced, technically your reaction is already balanced. But some professors do not want or they do not prefer to have fractions on balanced chemical reaction. They want whole numbers. So how do we remo remove the fraction? What we need to do is multiply the entire reaction, all the coefficients, by 2. So let's start with C8H18. The coefficient of C8H18 is 1. So 2 times 1, that's equal to 2. So it becomes 2C8H18 plus 2 times 25 halves, that's 25. So 25O2. 2 times 8, that's 16. So 16CO2. And 2 times 9, that's 18. So 18 H2O. Now let's check if this reaction is really balanced. 
Let's count quickly the number of C, H, and O on both the left and the right sides. So let's start with carbon. On the left side, we have 2 times 8. That's 16. On the right side, 16 times 1. That's also 16. So carbon is balanced. For hydrogen, on the left side, we have 2 times 18. That's 36. On the right side, we have 18 times 2. That's 36. So hydrogen is balanced. And for oxygen, on the left side, we have 25 times 2. That's 50. On the right side, we have 16 times 2. That's 32 plus 18 times 1. That's 18. So 32 plus 18 is 50. So oxygen is already balanced. So the balance equation for the complete combustion of octane is this one. 2C8H18 plus 25O2. The products are 16CO2 and 18H2O.